doing of it from this beta, it is not very good. I want to open this video with that announcement because editing and laughter and videos are like trailers. They can make something that's terrible seem really good. I recently saw a trailer for Star Wars Episode 1 that was cut in the style of the episode, mo most recent Episode 7 trailer with that amazing music and it made me want to go watch Episode 1. Now don't get me wrong, I love Star Wars Episode 1, it's a hell of a lot better than Star Wars Episode 2, but it's not a good movie. So just be aware, this isn't very good. With that in mind, let's be a shill and play some of it. And we're in the game! Wonderful! This is my park. There's a lot of land to play with here, and you can see the name of it up the top there. It's aptly named. Uh, it's still Halloween themed. It's... I mean, by the time you're seeing this video, it's absolutely not Halloween anymore, but sure, that's great. Let's go to paths and queues. Let's uh, start, you know, P's and Q's, the way we mean to go on. Let's see, what do we want to use? Do I want to make a beautiful looking park or something that's... I'm gonna go with steel. Good solid steel pathways. Because that's not going to look ridiculous. We're going to curve the path over this way. Does that look all right? That looks uh, shiny as hell, actually. Shiny and sci-fi as hell. I don't know that I like it, but we'll stick with it. That one actually... I kind of want that rounded one, I'm going to be honest. I, I kind of want the rounded one. Let's bulldoze my pathway. Goodbye, pathway. Uh, give me the straight path. Give me the rounded thing. And beautiful. Right. That's a nice color. Let's, uh, let, let's, I mean, okay, let, let's, let's even with you first. This is Better Weekend 1, and this is supposed to be nothing more than a test of the coaster buildings, so the buildings and flat rides aren't in the game yet. That's okay, uh, but it's still, how can I put this nicely, uh, not very good. I mean, yeah, that's beautiful. <laughs> that's beautiful. Good job, me. Right. Let's uh, let's see what we can do there. Let's make a coaster. Let's see a hyper coaster, wooden coaster. I mean, we uh, let's uh, hyper coaster. Let's make a hyper coaster. Um, that's an interesting looking building. It's certainly better than the default one. That's interesting, and that's sci-fi. Okay, sci-fi it is. We're making a sci-fi themed park, apparently. Uh, which, interestingly, I seem to be able to put part of this building on my pathway. Which I don't approve of. And then this co oh, comes out this way, really? Right, the question is... Okay, so, I think this mention it needs to be like 200 feet in height. Uh, and I actually did the calculation. 200 feet is 60 meters. Uh, which it's not gonna let me bloody do because it comes out that end. Okay, can I... Can I make this work? Can I? No, 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 no. No, this is literally not going to work, is it? This, this is okay. This, this is dumb. Forget it. We're doing it. <laughs> Moving it. There we go. Right. We'll put it elsewhere. We'll put it. We'll put ourselves a hyper coaster on this side instead, because that seems like it would make sense. So no, it doesn't. It'd be better that way. Actually, it'd totally be better that way, because then the yeah, so there we go. Right, now this needs to immediately go up. Otherwise, it's totally going to kill people. Uh, so I want to use... I'm actually just going to use a chain lift, I think. Chain lift seems to be the way to go. Actually, no. Let me use a booster. Boosters are more more fun. Uh, so we'll go with a regular booster there. Then angle it this way and up a bit. Uh, but I'd also like to angle it onto its side a bit. Just to mess with people, you know? Just so they, uh, absolutely brick it. Now, this does need to go up to 60 meters. That is one thing. This needs to go up to 60 meters in height, because that's 200 feet, and that's apparently what a hypercoaster does. Uh, so, can I... I actually can legitimately make that go upside down. I can legitimately make that spiral. Okay, that's kind of cool. So, it's currently upside down. It's gonna drop suddenly. Which is totally, totally not going to make people crap themselves. Um, actually, no. Let's take it the other way so it's an even more sudden drop. Uh, but maybe not angle it like that at the bottom. Okay, so give it a bit of a... Can I make this go back, like, the right way up? 
I absolutely can. But why would I do it that way? I should take it the other way. Curve it like that. Then bring it to here. Then curve it around like that. Now I need this to slowly angle itself to the sort of right way up. So something like that and then down even more. So that should be fine. Uh, then I want to sort of bring it through this way, but not, maybe not that, that steep of an angle, and up a bit, uh, and like that, and through there and angle it? That sort of works. I feel like another booster might be a good idea just to uh, keep it going nice and quickly. So something like that. Now the question is, can I get like a, can I get a loop in there? I feel like putting a booster there is probably a bad idea. Let's do uh, let's do the snake. We'll do the, we'll do the slithery snake there. That'll be fine. Then have it sort of come around like this. I feel like a booster is completely unnecessary there. Uh, let's see. So let's have this sort of angle itself like that. And then like that. And down. And then to there. Can I finish this? Oh, that's beautiful. Look at that. Let's do some friction brakes so it doesn't... You know, go straight into the station and uh, test it because that that might actually be a successful roller coaster. So it comes out, it boosts. I said it, bo it isn't boosting. I mean, it's certainly getting there, but I don't know if the booster's actually strong enough. Uh, that would absolutely be a no. Booster needs to be stronger. Let's go to. Uh, let's just go to. Maybe not 10. Let's go to like 7.75. That ought to do it. Then test it. That's got to be strong enough. That's got to be strong enough. It's got to be. Alright, that's a good speed. That is... Uh-oh, that's going to be way too quick, isn't it? And... Com yep. Some people's dead. They... They is dead. Uh, more people's dead. Well, that went well. Maybe, uh, maybe slow it down a little bit. Maybe just uh, just a little bit. Maybe like 6.4. So we're having some serious problems at this particular bend. So I'm going to make it much bigger. Uh, in the hopes that that'll solve our problems. That should work. Let's test it then. So it comes out. It's all good. Goes up like so. Comes around. Go, go, goes, goes up there. And goes around. Goes down. All is good at this point. Uh, swings way out. That's actually pretty cool. Comes over, it's... <laughs> yeah, that don't work, does it? That, that... Is that all booster tr uh, is Yeah, that's unnecessary. Uh, that can go back to being standard, I think. Because I think booster track there is a really bad idea. Uh, let's give this another quick test. Let's speed things up a little bit. So it shoots out. All is good. Uh, so it swings out around there. It comes in... No booster track. It still goes bloody mental, though. Uh, maybe angling that would be a good idea, because it does angle itself out that way. It kind of needs to angle itself the other way. Although that immediately goes red if I do that. So it angles straight like that. Can I get this to sort of angle? No, that actually really doesn't want to, uh, to angle, does it? I mean, I kind of need this to be... I need that to be a nice white curve. I need this to be a nice sort of... Oh, God. This is this is actually kind of tricky. That's a yellow curve now. Um, now it's a nice white curve. Okay, that's, that's better. Then this bit needs to be sort of like that, I guess. Yeah, that's useful. That's exciting. That's exciting. It's an exciting-looking roller coaster. Uh, if I angle it at all, it's going to crap itself, so let's maybe not do that. Uh, I can put a bit of a bump in there, though. That, yeah, that'll not kill people, or make them sick. A uh, bit more of a bump, I think. And uh, a bit more of a bump. Just, you know, just shake things up a little bit. You know, and by things, I mean the riders. That'll, <laughs> God, that'll be awful. So just just going along in the roller coaster, just bumping all over the bloody place. Right, let's uh, speed it up a little bit. Bring it around. It does all good. It uh, swings out that way. Gets to here. It's still good. And they're dead. And they're dead. 
it's literally always at this point, and I don't know why. I I honestly can't work out what it is, but maybe a break could be useful. Let's try the friction break there. See what happens. Because, I mean, that... I mean, it's going to be boring as hell with a friction break there, but I feel like that's kind of my only choice. To, I just want a successful roller coaster, to be honest. I, I'm not too interested in it being the most exciting bloody thing in the world. But as long as it doesn't kill people, then uh, I'm fine with it. So it swings around. Yeah, da, 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 da. Gets to here. Friction break. It still dies. This snake thing was the worst bloody idea I've ever had. And you know what's even bloody worse? The fact that you can't bulldoze a section of roller coaster to bulldoze the whole bloody thing. Like, why? Why do I have to bulldoze the whole bloody thing? That's just silly. That's just, it's just silly, but I'm gonna do it anyway. And a redesign. There we go. Very basic roller coaster. Goes up, suddenly drops you, swings you around and takes you back to the station. Miserable! That's certainly a word for it. But effective, we shall soon see. Because it is, it is gonna be a slow one. In fact, I'm gonna speed it up so that the chain speed's much higher. So, well, not much higher, but just a bit faster. Bloody chain's gonna be slow as hell. There we go, so it goes up on a good old chain. Do love me a good, it, go, it pretty much goes vertical as well, so that's uh, pleasant. Uh, slow things down a little bit. Still on the chain, the chain lets it go... there, apparently. Oh yeah, that goes really bloody slow. Good lord. But then it suddenly, it, it drops pretty quickly. Is it gonna be okay going around those bands? Absolutely, actually. Yeah, that's not bad. It's way too fast through the station, though. So I need some brakes here. Uh, no, I don't want brakes the whole way there. Oh, God, that's dreadful. Okay, can I... Can I even this out? Something like that, and then select this section. Yeah, there we go. So friction brakes just there. And that should totally be enough to slow it way down. So we will need to test that again, though, just to make sure that it stops. But it should absolutely stop. That should be fine. So... It goes up, does its thing. It actually crashed somewhere as well. That's, or maybe that's an old crash. I think that might be an old crash. Uh, so it swings down like that. That's so cool looking. Uh, so it swings down like that and does actually stop. Okay, good. Well, I want to do some editing to the train. I want to put more cars on it. Uh, and I want them to be the blue ones because it's, we're going for the sci-fi theme here apparently. Uh, so the blue cars, the ones I am interested in. And then that little one at the front as well. There we go. Uh, that's pretty cool. It's not so bad. And then color. That's, uh, let's go for color. I think just a general theme of blue on this one. So something like that. Then the second bit can be like a darker blue. Yeah, that's pretty good. Then the pillars can be maybe just white. Or maybe a really light blue. I'll go with blue, yeah. That's... I like that. That's pretty good. That is... That is that is definitely pretty good. Uh, let's do a queue then from there. Okay, maybe not from there. From there to like... There. So now they can get on the roller coaster. Uh, it is the sci-fi queue as well, so that's all good. And the exit is just going to be from there to... Uh... Okay, maybe we'll curve this actually. Bring it out like that. Sort of curve it around uh, like that. Right, so we have a roller coaster. Let's open it. That that should be absolutely excellent. They'll they'll love it, right? They'll they'll totally love it. Anyone gonna use it? You're using it, you're there, Keen. There we go. Alright, let's see. How many people are actually gonna get on my coaster? And are they gonna die? That's a fairly important question too. Well it's off. I mean there's a lot of people queuing up to get on there. It's uh it's going up, it's going up. Now let's make sure they don't die. Let's also make sure it works with that many cars on it. We didn't test it with the uh, the extra cars on there. Uh, so far, so good. And does it stop? It did. Excellent. That's that's good. A lot of people on there now.